Hey there guys, how's it going? So welcome back here for another episode of our Pokemon Ultra Sun Nuzlocke. Uh, previously we got through with the trainer school, and I, um, if you guys want to see a very wholesome video, I actually put a video of me giving a gift to my niece, so if you guys would like to see that, um, I'll put a link into the description below. It is quite an adorable video, so, just saying. Alright, now we're in Hula, or who allow city beachfront? I completely almost botched that. Whoo, guys, let me tell you, it is chilly. It is cold. Oh, we're supposed to actually get some snow today, which is going to be awesome trying to get to work in that snow. Beach time, yay. That's right, he is in my normal voice. Hey, you. Yeah, you over there. You've come to Alola from someplace far off, haven't you? I can tell. Alright, this is really part of the thing that I hate. Um, proper way to greet someone, Alola, whatever. But the beginning is like so much talk, it's not even funny. Um, I have been playing through this a little bit beforehand, just so you guys know. So, I haven't really been going out and talking to a lot of NPCs. I'm actually just working on getting uh, through the game so we can get shiny hunting done. You can trade, I think, between sun and ultra sun and moon and ultra moon. So I should have a, my Pokedex going up soon. We could do some shiny hunting and ultra sun. I'm excited for that. Woo! Hopefully you guys are excited too. If you guys are excited for that, put hashtag, hashtag hype dumb into the comment section. It would be greatly appreciated. Because I know some of you guys do love shiny hunting. I do want to get into some VGC. Because Linoon, 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 Linoon. I'm so excited. Hey, miss. Is it true that you can get some kind of special gift if you have a Rotom Dex? All right, I'm not going to lie. I really do hate this this part right here. The, it's like the part that I hate the most. My goodness, you have... Or you got the news fast. Hardly anyone has a Rotom Dex. But it is true. We have a special item to go with it. It's our very own Pokey Finder. Here you go. Awesome! Alright. Isn't it awesome, Blue Phoenix? You got a Poke Finder. Do 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 do! So, like, what's a Poke Finder? <laughs> the Poke Finder is a tool that lets you take photos of Pokemon. Rotom will help point out places where you'll be able to take photos too. Here, I'll read you the instruction manual. Tap on Rotom and press R. Yup. That's pretty much it. Alright. Man, that Rotom Dex is cool. It's like a whole nother partner. Blue. F oh, I almost said Blue Phoenix. I'm just gonna call myself Blue. I mean on top of your Pokemon partner. Oh yeah. But I guess since it's Rotom inside, it's pretty much... It already is a Pokemon partner. Blah, 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 blah. You're pretty darn lucky. I'm gonna leave because this is boring. The photos you snap with Pokemon with the Pokefinder, they're simply too cute to resist. Um, right here, if you want to talk to this man, if you've caught 10 or more Pokemon, um, you will get, I think it was like 10 Ultra Balls or something. So, that's actually pretty awesome. That could be useful for anyone who is looking to get Ultra Balls pretty darn early. How did you visit, or did you visit the Tourist Bureau? How was it? We got his Rotom Dex upgraded. Now I could take pictures too. Sweet. What a wonderful helper you are, Rotom. Alright, flash. Huh? Aha. What was that for, Rotom? Go and put that little trickster back in your bag, Blue, and follow me. Enough feasting for the eyes. It's time to feast for our stomachs. Alright, maybe Rotom wanted to get your attention because it wants to take photos with you. Alright, so as you guys may know, when I'm actually doing some of this talking, I do improvise. If I think of something on the spot that's better than what they're saying, I'll say it. Like, he was like, um, let's go take care of our stomachs, but instead let's go feast for our stomachs. Sounds a little bit better. I don't know. I do like to improvise a little bit. It keeps me... I don't know. Because I do really lose track of, I don't know, the text because it does get really, I don't know, for me it gets boring after a while with all this. Alright, just gonna spam the A button here. 
Like I said, I don't care too much for the Poke Finder. It, it's not bad. I won't rather have Pokemon Snap. But if it was between this and Pokemon Snap, like, I don't know. I'd rather, still rather have Pokemon Snap. Just saying. Pokemon, or Pokemon Company, do it. Game Freak. You gotta do it. Alright, A. It's gonna say, do I want to save this to a card? Ooh, thumbs up. Yay. Done. We can, guys, catch a Pokemon here. And there's one Pokemon that I have in mind that I really would really love. So I'm hoping we can get him. Or her. We can get it. But we do have one thing we gotta do first. Oh, we passed a sticker! Yeah, there's, um, you can actually get totem stickers. I think there's like 100 in total. And I found one over there. Of course I do. I pick out my own clothes, Lily. Of course. Most people do. Don't, uh, oh, I'm not even doing her voice. I've always just worn clothes that my mother wanted me to wear. I don't really know what kind of thing would suit me. But that's not why I stopped you. You're telling, uh, n I don't even buy, or I didn't even buy anything, but they said I was the 9,900... 99,999th customer to visit the store. But I already have the same one, so I thought maybe you would want it. Sweet. Um, I'm actually gonna go in there, and I'm going to buy a new pair of pants and a new shirt. Because, you know, why not? We don't want to look the same throughout our whole playthrough. Usually I don't do clothes till like, post-game to make myself look cool during battles. But, we're gonna do something here with this. Alright, um, I don't want the tank top, Alola shirt, tank top, tank top, tank top, what am I looking for guys, what am I looking for, polo shirt, um, orange, pink, beige, surfing tank, is that, hang on, is that a surfing Pikachu, alright, well I'm gonna buy this just because I can, alright, so I want, where is it? Where is it? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Up a little higher? Up a little higher, maybe? Alola shirt. No. Or maybe this is just a different version, so I can't pick up the one that I wanted. I think that's the case. Because... Oh, not red. Because I usually go with um, black and blue. But I might not have the chance... Yeah, because I think the warm colors are in sun, the colder colors are in blue, or sun, and the other ones are... Oh, I forgot to put them on. Whoops. Alright, well, we'll just... We'll just run over and put them on quick. But, yeah, one is in Ultra Sun, the other one's in Ultra Moon. So, I can't really do much with that. I'm gonna put that on. We got pants, we're gonna put on the Black Capri's pants. We're gonna change our clothes. Maybe maybe we'll try black and red. I I don't know. But I'm cool with all black. Besides for the Caprizi pants, I'm more of a blue jeans kind of guy, if you ask me. That's pretty much all I have. I don't have a pair of shorts. Nuh-uh. But what was I saying? Oh, yeah, the sticker right there. For any of you guys that did not notice, there is a nicely put sticker there. I probably won't try to hunt them down. If anything, maybe I'll do that end game. Yeah, you know what? I think I'll hunt all of them down at the end game. So that way you guys can see. Alright, um... So you spotted me sticking up one of these lovely stickers, haven't you? Yeah, that that's a sticker. Oh yes, and that is vandalism. If a young trial goers collect these stickers as they travel and follow the path that or they indicate, they are quite natural or they quite naturally progress along their island challenge. Huh. That is a pretty cool sticker. And sorry, I know my voice is actually sounding pretty weird. Here, I'm just going to skip through this while I'm talking, though. Um, yeah, I know um, the whatchamacallit. My voice is sounding actually a little bit weird. But that's because I'm still a little bit sick. I got home. I actually had to call in from work. I was running a pretty high temperature. Not exactly what I wanted. I wanted a fur frow. We can actually get fur frows in this area. But Alolan Grimer, I'm okay with that. We haven't got. Did I? 
Yeah, sorry guys, I, I keep hitting that button. But I don't mind an Alolan Grimer. We haven't even got one of these, or haven't even really used one of these yet. Oh darn it, I'm poisoned. Um, here, let's just try to lower his accuracy a little bit. I gotta be a little bit careful in case of a crit. Super effective. Maybe one more should do it. But then we're gonna have another Pokemon on our team. And Grimer is actually quite an interesting one at that. Let's see. Bam! You know, I can get away with another one. I'm already poisoned. Um, I should be fine. One more should... I should be okay with. Quick Claw! Didn't really matter because I'm already faster! There we go. He's gonna use Pound. Yep, I'm gonna live this poison too. I'm gonna do a Pokemon switch here. Because we don't want Pinches to die. We're gonna put out Blip. Blips is Steel type, so Poison type attacks won't really affect me too much. Which is going to be the amazing part. Grimer is using Harden. Not a big deal. Not at all. Alright, um... I got Quick Balls. I got five Great Balls. Let's use one. I don't want to take a chance of missing. Like... I don't know. Like, I kind of want to get this show on the road a little bit, kind of gung-ho to everything. Um, yeah, and we need to check. I need to figure out what I'm going to call him. Um, I know once he evolves, he will turn into something. Uh, like, Rainbow. I would have loved to call him Rainbow. But, hmm. All right. <sighs> Cold. Alright, there are hundreds or so living in the Alola Waste Disposal Site. They're all hard workers who eat a lot of trash. Alright, we need to give a nickname for this Grimer. Let's call it... <laughs> for any of you guys that have seen... Well, it's female though. For any of you guys that have seen this... I think I'm spelling this right. Yeah, close enough. But it we're calling him Rick Grimes. Or her Rick Grimes. It, it's just because of the Grimer. Rick Grimes the Grimer. Alright. We found a revive. No real use for those. Um, we should be getting a few of these as well. They're pretty much just gonna be good for selling. Really only good for selling. Um, I'm gonna need to do a switch. I honestly should have switched my Pokemon beforehand. We'll put in Zoo. Yeah, you know what? Then we'll kill this thing. We'll get a little extra experience because I know we're gonna be facing... Uh, we're gonna be having a hard time. I don't know exactly what Lima Smeargle has, but that Smeargle scares the living bejeebers out of me. Um, I don't know if it has a, a an attack that acts... Owen Tempo for the win. I'm not gonna lie, I really do love this Owen Tempo. And the only way to evolve evolve him is getting it to level 25 and doing it by like 6 o'clock. Which is going to be a hard, hard, hard thing, so he might not evolve for a while. Alright, so now my problem is... Can I... There we go. Watch this be a fur frow. Watch it be a Magnemite. <laughs> Duh. Alright. So, I'm gonna switch pinches in with Zoo again. Zoo's got that lovely Fire Fang. And I'm cool with that. That Fire Fang is going to come and come to be a big help. Especially, well, not so much. Because everything that can hit him, it's like super effective. So, it's gonna be kind of like situational. But I will keep Fire Fang on. That's an egg move. I was hoping... Gosh darn it. Why must you Thunder Wave? Please stop Thunder Waving. Ah, no. I'm paralyzed and can't move. Okay, I could... We're gonna try one more time. I should be able to live another attack. Oh. Pff. He went for another tackle. Fire Fang, he's gone. I'm gonna actually run into the Pokemon Center. We're going to heal up. Then I think, 
Hmm. Yeah, and I think we'll just kind of call it... No. Yeah, we'll call it quits. Um, yeah, we've had a lot of longer episodes. Why not make this one just a tad bit shorter for everyone? We did get uh, our Pokemon, Rick Grimes. We got into the city. And that was... I don't know. That seems pretty good to me. So if you guys have enjoyed this episode, make sure to leave a like down below. Always greatly appreciate with that. I will see you guys in tomorrow's episode. Have a good one, my lovely peoples. Peace.